I'm Andrew Sagel with Mega, and this, this is the MPQ 2000 Power Quality Analyzer. What we're going to discuss today is the methods of powering the unit when you're in the field with it. The MPQ 2000 can be powered either off the phase A input or it can be powered off a standard 115, 230 volt, 50 or 60 hertz outlet. Or the unit can actually run for up to five hours off its own internal battery. To power the unit off of phase A, the phase A voltage must be between 90 and 600 volts AC or between 100 and 600 volts DC. If your phase A voltage is outside this range, then you either need to power off a standard AC outlet or off the internal battery of the unit. When powering off of phase A, be sure the power selector switch located on the front panel of the unit is set to the phase A position. You should feel this click into place. This should be changed before you apply power to phase A. You can now connect your phase A power leads to the unit and you can clip them to your source. When powering the unit off of phase A, be sure the safety ground is connected to the unit and connected to earth ground. If during the recording the phase A voltage should drop below 90 volts, then the unit will continue to record for up to five hours off the internal battery. To power the unit off of auxiliary or a standard AC outlet, you would first plug in the power cord. This cord is a CAT4 rated cord at 600 volts. To plug the cord in, you would simply insert the cord into the, into the auxiliary input and then rotate it to the right until you hear it click. Okay. The cord has different ends for different power configurations. It comes standard with a US plug, a United Kingdom plug, and a European plug. When powering off of auxiliary, be sure that the power selector switch is set to the auxiliary mode. You should hear the switch click into position. And again, always set the switch before you plug the unit in. If the unit loses power during the recording, it will continue to record for up to five hours off its internal battery. When powering off battery, it doesn't matter what position the power selector switch is in. It is recommended to still connect the safety ground to the unit when you are powering off a battery. And there you have it. Power the unit off phase A, power the unit off a standard AC line cord, power the unit off a battery. The MPQ2000 has the versatility you need for any location. How do you determine what current clamp to select for your recording? There are many different types of current clamps out on the market today. Some of those types include the split core CT, the flexible current clamp, as well as the Hall effect current clamp.